Hello, welcome back to Cracking the Cryptic. And today we are going back to the gas tank again. So more of the genuinely approachable Sudoku puzzles from the daily Sudoku channel on the Discord server that are created by Clover, Sam Kappelman, Lyons and Philip Newman. I will attempt to do five puzzles. So the way the video will go, we will learn the rules of the five puzzles. I'll then solve them as quickly as I can. Um, and then we'll see how I've done overall. That's kind of the plan. So these will be coming up in a moment. We'll go through the rules in a moment. First of all, I want to thank you if you're watching this as it comes out, because we are streaming at the moment. The Bubba is You stream is continuing on the live stream, um, and that is still on this channel as well. But thank you if you've either stopped watching it or you weren't watching it because you wanted to see this video. You know that puts you amongst my favorite people. But of course, Anybody who watches this at any point qualifies pretty much for that tag as well. So thank you for watching. Um, that stream is going on. We also, of course, have a few days left in the padlocked contest, the Lockout Lions pack that's on Patreon. Um, and of course, our apps and merchandise still going strong. They're all available on the links under the video. And the first five links of the video are these five puzzles. So what have we got? We've got Full Rank by Clover, this first one. Um, okay, imagine each row and column read in either, in either direction as a nine-digit number. So there are 36 of these numbers. That's, you know, this could say 1, 2, 8, 3, 7, 6, 5, 4, 9. And that number effectively represents 128 million, whatever I said, 673,549. Um, and the other way round would be another of these nine digit numbers, which would, I can't remember the numbers I said, but it would go something like 9453768281 and would be 945 million and something. So imagine putting those 36 nine digit numbers in order from smallest to largest. The value outside a row or column tells you where the corresponding nine-digit number appears in that list. For instance, a value of one above a column would tell you the column read top to bottom contains the smallest of the 36 numbers. So we know here that this is the smallest of the 36 numbers, and this is the largest of the 36 nine-digit numbers. Quite an odd subject for a gas puzzle. I've seen it in competition before, but certainly not on the gas list. Now, the next one we have had before, this is odd Sudoku. Normal Sudoku rules reply. Digits placed in gray circles must be odd. Much quicker to explain. This one is a thermo by Philip Newman. Ring of fire, it's called. We can see the ring there. A bit like a brand, actually, it is. Uh, so along the thermos, digits must increase from the bulb to the tip. Quite rare in gas to have a thermo puzzle with no given digits. I'll point that out. Well, I don't know what this is. T-O-W-T-B-A-R-T. Outbark by Clover. A red upwards pointing triangle gives the location of the highest digit in its cage. A blue downwards triangle gives the location of the lowest digit in its cage. Now, I don't know if we're going to have to try and work out what Tout Bart stands for. It looks, I mean, it's all in caps, so it must be initials. The other, no, I don't know. The one where the, the one with the blue and red triangles. That's what it stands for. I'd be confident about that. Right, and even Sudoku. Oh, this is a companion to the odd Sudoku. And there's a sort of arrow in the grid. Wasn't there something like that in the odd Sudoku? Yes, an arrow of digits in the grid. Oh, my goodness. How It's not actually the same numbers. It is. Look. Oh, that is magnificent by Sam. It is the same given digits, the same positions for the markings, but they're even in this one and odd in this one. He is something else, isn't he? That's insane. Anyway, do have a go at these puzzles. I'm really looking forward to this now, although maybe not this first one. We'll see how it goes. Um, right, I must try and remember to start the clock so I know my time every time. Here we go. Let's get cracking. Okay, well, the 
there has to be a one in the first column. So the smallest number in the 36 has to begin with a one. The largest number has to begin with a nine. So those are write-ins. We've got a nine in 34th position. 33rd, yeah, I mean, yes, we know that the nine, this must be a nine to be the 35th number, higher than the 34th. And there must be a number in the top four coming down, starting with a nine. So that's there. So those are all givens. What about this 30? Now, the, yeah, that's just 31 begins with an 8. Again, there must be a number beginning with an 8 on the right. So 30 is there. 32 obviously begins with an 8 there. We know 29 began with an 8 because that's given. 2 and 3, again, there must be a 1 both on the left, both on the bottom and on the right. Ah, but 5 can't be a 1. That's going to have to be a 2 because 6 is a 2, so 5 is a 2. Beginning digits are easy. It gets harder when you have to kind of mess around after that. Now, the seventh number doesn't begin with a three or a one. It's got to be a two. This eighth number is probably a two. Yeah, we had a fifth number on the bottom, sixth number on the right, seventh number on the left. The one beginning with two on the left is the eighth. Right, so that's all the first digits. Now let's try and do regular Sudoku as far as we can. Where do we start with that? I don't know. Um, we can put a one in there. Seven, six, and five. That's five or six. Eight, nine, three. We get a four somewhere, and five, six, and seven. Oh, God forbid we have to start getting into these um, second digits of these numbers this early because that doesn't, it's not an easy task. Seven has to be in one of those, otherwise they're from four, five, and six. That's four or six, right. Six, one, two, eight. Not that helpful. Okay, so we're going to have to start ordering some of these. So one is one, two, eight. Two, oh. One, two down here starts one, two, eight, three, nine. So this has to be less than three, nine. So that has to be a seven. Oh, that is very helpful. Right. We get a four, six pair there. This is a five, seven pair here. Well, that's tidied up stuff. So that was number one and two. Three begins one, nine something. So four begins one, nine, three. So three begins, oh look, one, nine, three, eight, four. And this is smaller at one, nine, three, eight, two. Okay, so we get a three there. So we can put a three in box three. Six, four, five, seven. Ah, those are the numbers needed in the bottom row. So that's a quadruple. Two, one. So we place eight and we've got a three, nine pair. Now let's look at number five. Uh, excuse me, one second. Right, sorry about that. That will add to my time, annoyingly. Um, six, five, seven, and four have to be disposed around here. Oh, yes, I was going to look at the numbers. Number five begins two, one. Number six begins two, four, six, or seven. Number seven begins two, five, six, or seven. And number eight can't begin two, three. Must begin to nine. So there's three there. That's from four, five, or seven. So seven is higher than six. That's not that helpful. Right, let's have a look at the higher numbers. 36, oh, begins nine, five. That's not very high. So 34 must begin nine, four. And that is very helpful. 33 must be in between, 35 I missed out, must be in between 947 and 95 something. So it must be 95 something as well. Um, 956 and then 36 is higher than that. So this must be 958. 
think this is right. It's quite complicated to get your head around this stuff, in my opinion. Um, just looking at fours, they have to be in one of those cells, one of those cells, one of those cells. Ah, and one of oh, one of those cells. So that does fix where four is in the central box. Might have been time wasted, but anyway, thirty six is nine five eight. Thirty five is nine five six or seven. Thirty four is nine four seven. Thirty three has to be less than a four. That is a one or a two. What have we got to go in this column? One, two, and four. The four has to be here because there's a four pair there. So nine, one, two, four, six, three, four, seven. That's an eight. Seven, four, nine. That's become a six. That sorts out four and six. We've got two and one. This is the sort of puzzle I could get something wrong and not notice. This is a naked single nine. That's five or six. So eight goes there. We've got a five, six pair. One, four, eight, nine, two, and then a three, seven pair. Now there certainly are um, cells I haven't looked at. Five, four, nine, six, eight. That's a naked single seven. Sorry, there aren't cells that I haven't looked at. There are clues outside the grid clues that I haven't really studied and I'm hoping to get away with not doing it eight nine five six see column five is very helpful there g one two six seven eight so this is a four five nine set that's a five now yes we can finish the column and finish not quite all of box four this is a four six pair. No, that's not done. Right. So twenty nine is eight. Must be less than eight seven five. I don't know. That doesn't help. Thirty is eight seven five. Thirty one is eight seven six. That's all right. Thirty two has to be bigger. So that's eight seven nine. So that is helpful. Two, oh, that's seven, five is done. Yes, should have seen that. Six, four, seven, that triple's done. That does the four, six pair. Five and four, we must be able to finish now. Three, we've got two, seven, one, six. There we go. So I think that is right. The time stops at 8.24. It's not too bad for this sort of puzzle. So let me just check the order. One, two, eight, three, seven, five. One two eight three nine six five seven four one nine three. Oh yeah, one nine three eight two one nine three eight four. So they were the really helpful ones. Then we had two one three four two four six seven two five four seven two nine one four. That all works. And then when we jump up to number twenty nine eight six seven nine eight seven five six eight seven six nine. 8792, yes. 9214, 9472, 9561, 9581, yes. Okay, so I think we've got that right. Phew. Let's move on to this odd Sudoku. I love this idea, Sam. Anyway, right. Um, restart the clock and get cracking. Nine and nine. Oh, no. Nine doesn't have to be in the odd circle there. Three, though, has to be there. There's a seven in one of those cells and in one of those. I mean, it'll be quite interesting to see when we get onto the other, the other puzzle with the same givens, whether we're looking at the same patterns to start with, as it were, in terms of logic. Three in one of those. I'm really finding a lot here. Maybe I need to use the clues better. So we've got five, three, seven, and nine all looking at that. So that's a one. What about this? That's five or seven. Okay, let's try and pick up these odds. Yes, that's a three. Sees all the other odds. That's not going to work as well. 
Oh, or maybe in this one, that's one or five. That's a one. It sees nine, seven, three, and five. Yes, okay, I've done those in the right order. That's one or seven. Uh, that one's not so useful. One, three, seven. So that's down to five or nine. Um, yes, okay, let's have a look at these. That's one or seven. That's one or seven. That's one, five or seven. That's not very useful. Nor is that. Oh, that's close to being useful, but not quite. Three, five, one. Ah, oh, that is it. That's a nine. So one, seven, and a three, five pair left. So that is very good. Right. Seven, one, three, or five, I reckon there. These aren't resolved. Now, there's not much look across, but that seven is looking up here. Four, five, two, eight. We get a seven in one of those two. There must be a one here. That's the only place it can go in the box. So that's not a one. Um, five, eight, two, one. That's a naked single six. That's a seven. That's a three. So that box is done now. And that's fixed the five, three pair there. That makes this seven and this one. Suddenly, most of these odd cells are falling into line. So that's where nine goes. Two and eight pair. One, seven, nine. Five must be in one of those. Four must be in one of those. And six in one of those. Little triple. We've got oh, eight. One of those, I'm marking this in the other form as I'm weird, but that's an equally chocolate teapot sort of nonsense. Ah, we get this seven now. Six, seven, nine. Okay, so the column four, two, and eight to place. Ah, oh, not that helpful. Five is in one of those two cells. Four nine three six one. Just looking across the top, I'm looking at all the wrong things. Nine. That's the right thing. Get yeah, a nine there. Five. So those are from two, four, and eight. That one can't be eight. That one can't be two. Three has to be down here somewhere. Oh, come on. Three, four, six, five, seven. That's two or eight, which makes a pair, which ought to be useful. Yes, it makes this a naked single seven. So, five, two, eight. so we've got four or six there. We can place nine. That's reducing the possibilities in the odd circle at the top. Oh, we can fix nine by regular Sudoku rules. Ah, still struggling around. Oh, that five across there has made that a four, which fixes that triple. Four, four, that's a four now. That's a naked single two. Why can't I see that three? Maybe the gray cells are a little bit concealing for some reason. Seven, two, four, and eight. That's the four. Don't know about two and eight. That's the six. Yes, we do the one seven pair. Now we've got five two six at the top. That's a five six two eight three. That's a four eight pair now, which makes this two and five there. That's become a naked single eight. So that does this whole. Quadruple, one, five, three and eight here. Yep, they can be done. Two and four, that fixes all the eights and twos. Many of them there are. So the Yoda and, oh, I thought I'd put in a one there. There it is. So that's not bad, just under six minutes for that one. Five minutes, 54.
Okay, it'll be very interesting to see when we get to the even Sudoku what's going on. Right, ring of fire. This is a thermo Sudoku. We restart to get my clock going. Are these one, two, three, four, five? Yes, they're right in nine cell thermos. Not slow thermos, just checking the rules. So that's a right in, and it looks like this one is the same length. In they go, and it's very unusual for Philip to give us so many digits straight away. <laughs> um, but not unusual for me to mistype some of them. So there we go, that's a start now. This one can't begin with a one. Two, three, four, five, six. Three, four, five, six. Ah, even better, this can't be seven or eight. This can't be six. So we are quite narrowed down straight away. This can't be six and this can't be five. So that was worth the thing. Oh, this can't begin with one, two, three, or four. So even though it's just two cells, I'm going to fill in the candidates. Um, this one's a bit less useful, actually. The, the, this one's five cells long, can't end in seven or eight. Four. Ah, no, can't be four, because this can't be one, two, or three. So that is four or, no, can't be four or five. So that's six or seven. Right, so we've got a seven, eight pair there. That looks significant. No, do I do those? No, I'm less interested now. Now I've got some info. There's four in that box. That makes that five. Okay, it's just three of the digits there. This is one or two. So these others are from one, two, three, and four. That's got to be a four. That's two or three. And that's two or three. So this is a one. And that's one or two. No, it can't be one anymore. Two. Okay, that's good. One, two. So we've got six, seven, and eight to place. Column six. That hasn't narrowed down at all as I thought it would. Nine in row six is there. One of those is a two. Six, seven, eight, nine, five, four. Oh, that's a naked single one. That's weird, just sitting there waiting to be done. Now that can't be a one, so there's a one in one of those positions, and then one of those, and in one of those, and in one of those. Ah. These are types. They're from seven, eight, nine. These are from two, three, and four. So five in this box has to be here. So it can't be there because of that. Or there because there must be a five there somewhere. So one of those is a four. This is a naked single nine. Probably should have seen that before. Those are from one, two, three. And six, seven, eight. This is a naked single five as well. Can't have a one there. So they're from two, three, and four. And that's a triple. So these are from six, seven, and eight. One of those must be a six, so that one isn't. It's all going swimmingly a moment ago. Now not. That can't be a six anymore. Where does five go in the column? No. Those are from six, seven, and eight. Six must be there, so these don't have a six. That's got to be a three. It can't be a one, and everything else is gone. Right. So I can finish the row suddenly. Six. And that gives me a one there. Four, five pair here. Um, well, how am I going to use that? Two, one, six, five, four. That is going to have to be a three now. Yes. 
and that's a 1 or a 2 by the thermo. Five or seven or eight there. It's not that helpful. That can't be a four, and one of these is a four, so the four is here. I've known one of those is a six. Well, that's not a four, so we've got a seven, eight, nine, triple. That has to be a two, it can't be three or four. Right, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine. Two, six pair there. That's become a one. Unsurprisingly, that makes that a one. Um, two, six, one, three, four, five. So that is from seven, eight, or nine. It's not that helpful. One of those, oh, there's a seven, eight pair there. So seven, eight, one, nine. This has to be a five, doesn't it? So that puts five there. There's no five here. That's where nine is in the box. That makes that an eight. Use the thermo. That's the way. Six, eight, nine on that little thermo in the end. That's not surprisingly, it was very constrained. That's not a nine. That is two or six here. But no, one of those has to be a six. So two there, three there, six and two done. This must be given. That's a seven. Six and eight pair, that's given as a seven, so we get eight and seven resolved down at the bottom. Eight there, this one is, in fact, we can do all of these six, seven, nine. No, still can't do the three and four, but that's an eight. That can't be four anymore. This is six and seven in that order. All right, let's get this box done. Five, two pair here, four, three pair next to them. Snip across and do the four, five pair, and then we can go up here. Yes, we can do six, eight now. That's become a three on the thermo. Must be able to do everything else. Three and four. There we go. Seven minutes, four seconds. I mean, not bad. It's a clever puzzle, that. That really isn't as easy as you think it might be when you start filling in the first thermos. Right, now, the one with the blue and red triangles. Pleased with working that out. Here we go. Let's start the clock and get cracking. Oh, digits in a cage can't repeat as well. Sorry, I didn't mention that, but that's quite important. So the blue is the lowest. So that's one or oh, it's one because this is a nine digit cage. Right. So this is a seven digit cage, and that can't be one or three. So that's a two. The highest can't be nine, and now we've got no one in the cage, so that's an eight. That means nine and one are not in the cage, so they are constrained there. One of these is a one, it's got to be the low digit. Oh, five was the high digit, right. It's worth spotting. Um... We've got any, yes, we've got five as the low digit, so it's a five, six, seven, eight, nine cage. And we can fill in seven and eight, we can do two and one now, so the central box is done. Um, two, one, that has to be seven, naked single, six there, eight and five, we've done that big cage. Right, three, seven, nine here. Red is the highest in the cage, so that's a nine. Um, seven. This is the lowest, it must be lower than three. Now I've got a six cell cage that I haven't. Oh, this is one, four, and eight. So one is the low digit, four and eight. This is higher than those, so it's a nine. Um, Uh, oh, this is 9876 in this, and we know therefore that the lowest is 6, the highest is 9. 7 and 8 there. This is, ah, oh, that's become a 2. Now I think, yes, 1 goes there, so this can be a 3 and that can be an 8, and that's dealt with that cage. 4 and 8 there, that's done with 7 and 3. 
do we know what these are? We know we need something bigger than a six in this. It's got to be a nine now. And this is the lowest. I don't know. I don't want to make any rash statements there. One, three, nine. It's got to be a seven, and it's got to be the higher of those. Seven are done. So that is four or six. These are from four, five, six, and eight. Can't be a six. We need a two and one in this box. They've got to be there. That is four or six. Oh, it can't be six. Just seen the six. Right. Three, six, nine. That's a four. These don't have a four. Uh, can't be an eight. This is five or seven. That's become a four, I've just spotted that. So that's a three, two pair. So four goes there in the final column, seven there, six there. One, four, eight, seven, six. We've got a nine here and a five naked single and a two, three pair still to go. Five, seven pair at the bottom can be done. That's a six as a result. That's now a five. This triple is done. Right, we've got nine, six, seven, one, two, so one of these is an eight, it's got to be the high one. The low one is a one or a two. This is five and three. So we need a lower digit than five or three. So that's also one or two. Put seven and four as a pair in there. So there's a five, which is the highest digit. Goes there, that's two or three. Hmm. So the nine now goes here and the one goes here. Um, this is three, four, five, six, seven. So these are eight and two as well, of course. They don't resolve anything. That's astonishing. Right, the five has fixed that three, five there. That's one or four. This is a naked single seven. Right, that's going to get it all done. Get a one there. Doesn't get it all done. That's three, six, nine. Can I do the three, two? Yes. So four, five, six, three pair. Still, okay, two, one. That's going to fix all the two ones. And even the three and two pair is done. So that's a three. This is a four. And there we go. That's quicker, I feel. Five minutes, 19 seconds. Interesting rule set. Never seen that before. And finally, on to the even Sudoku by Sam. Let's see how we do with the same givens. Uh, let's get cracking. Ah, nine is easily placeable now because it's not even. Um, so we focus on the ones that aren't even because they're helpful. We still get that three in the middle. Seven in one of those cells. Now seven has to be there. That's fine. Three in one of those. Ah, oh, nine is actually placed there. I should have remembered that. So that gives us a nine, thanks to the rule this time. Nine. We must have done all the nines now. I reckon that's the lot. Yes. Um... So I think it is profitable to work on the odds. Five, for instance, has to be in one of those cells. So it has to be there because it has to stay out of the even cells. Oh, of course, we've got a, a set of two, four, six, eight here. So the six has to be here. The eight has to be here. Oh, my God, they could be written in. Did not expect that. What about this set of two, four, six, eight? That's a six, naked single. Oh, the other's not quite so straightforward, but that's fair enough. Right, eight nine six four two. Difficult to do the rest. Let's pencil mark a two in one of those. And this is yeah, this is a naked single. Six. This now can't be two, six, or four. This is given, yeah. This one is not. 
Okay, fair enough. But we've got plenty of benefit out of what we can do. Four goes there, and that place is seven. This must be a two eight pair. Yes, I do know the order. One three there. This is not helping. One three six nine. So we've got four to go in somewhere up here, but that could be even, obviously. That's a one two pair. Well, we know which one of those is even. So seven, eight must be in one of these two cells with five. So four is there and three we can place. Four fixes this as a two, as did the four, eight pair that I hadn't seen. Six and seven can go in. Oh, I can't do anything else there. Right. I don't know where I'm meant to be looking next. Nine, three, six. That's where six is in row six. One of those is four. Four. That has to be a four because of the pair at the top. Um, three, one, five, and eight to go. Eight must be there, in fact, same pair. That's one or five. That's where seven is in the row. And we can do the three and one as well. Five and two are right ins. One, three, and five down here somewhere. Let's do that. This is a seven five pair. So we at least know that's a one. That's five. We've got a one three pair. One. Um, the five fixes the eight pair there and the eight pair here. That doesn't give us a four. F seven there from one, four, and three. And four. Right, three can't be there. So three is here. Five and one can be done. That three sorts out the bottom pairs. Five, one, two, nine, six, eight. Or seven there. Neither of these is a one. And one, six, eight. That's a seven. That does do the rest of box six. Then we can do one, one and seven, two and eight, seven, five. Now that's become a one, which is very helpful. Four, three, seven, two digits to go. And that's it. There is our guess for the week. Four minutes, 37, quickest puzzle at the end. Um, I don't know. It felt a very different solution path to the puzzle with the same givens and the so similar markings. Really impressive feat by Sam to cap that off this week. But uh, equally, that was a tough, I don't know, it shouldn't have taken as long as eight and a half minutes, that global one. But it's hard. it's a hard rule set to get used to and to use. Then there was the Sam. That was a nice puzzle by Philip. Really clever. Uh, but not too difficult. Just needed a bit of care with the central thermos, I think. Enjoyed that. The uh, one with the blue and red triangles by Clover. And uh, that was nice as well. Very nice as well. Real treat, this wow. set. Uh, thank you so much for watching. And uh, as always, hope you catch up with the stream at some point if you're watching this first. And I uh, hope to see you again soon on the channel. Bye for now.